Hi there. So, you bought a box of bananas, thinking you're thrifty. You're thrifty Steve over here. And they're catching up to you. They're ripening faster than... Frank the... Sprinter. I don't know any sprinters. The Jamaican guy. The Bolt. What about that guy? <laughs> okay. So... I have a little technique, this is what I've been doing. So you can see that these bananas here, to my left, are pretty much ready to eat, but in a couple days, they'll be fruit fly pudding. So let me show you what to do about it. I am a vegan, you are a loser. You already know the answer, don't you? You freeze them, but I bet you didn't know this technique. Sure, you could do this. You could take the banana bunch, open the freezer door with your strong vegan pinky finger. Wow. Then you throw it in there. That's what idiots do. Your next option would be to peel every banana, put them in a large Ziploc bag, put them into the freezer. That's what Kent subscribers do. The best option is getting in touch with your body. You gotta know yourself. You gotta know. Oh my god, how many bananas would that take? That's like a hundred. You gotta know how many bananas you would eat in a meal. This is for smoothies for me. I don't eat bananas on their own. That's the dumbest thing anybody could ever do. Who would ever do that? It's the dumbest food on earth. At least Canadian bananas, even though they don't grow here. I don't know why they grow in the right place, and then they come here and they're stupid. I myself, three bananas, I'm done. So I don't need more than three, so I freeze three at a time. I'll show you how to do it in case you were dropped on your head as a baby like I was. So I needed to watch a tutorial on this, but that's okay. You take your bag, you take your bananas, you peel them, you take them off the thing, you're doing good, you're doing fine in life, you're throwing the peel in the compost, you're a happy human being, you maybe break it in half, you throw it in that bag there, look at that, you're almost done, you're a third of the way done, you just keep on peeling that, you're enjoying yourself, you're happy, only a loser would think this is work. You're having fun. You're thinking of your dreams right now. You're thinking of all the things you want to accomplish on this earth. You're a success. You're a good person. What do you know about that? You got your bag. You start the process of closing it. Once you're almost done, that didn't work. Stupid Ziploc piece of sh <laughs> You squeeze out. Boo. You're done. You're done. How easy was that? Sure, you have 50 more to do, but the hard part's over. So that's my tip. I imagine you could do this with any fruit that is over ripening. Don't throw out that fruit. Fruit is expensive enough when you factor in the fact that you lose like 50% of it to going bad, that just becomes millionaire wasteful mentality food. I'm actually shocked on how good I feel on such less food than I think I need. It's always so shocking. We think we need to carb up. I don't know why Durian Rider put that into our minds. Get it out. It's not healthy. I tell you. When I go out, I eat one banana. I've done this a couple times, so I know. I eat one banana and one date, and then I go. And I'm, I'm shocked at how much energy I have for hours. For hours. Save your big meal for the end. Make a big meal of greens. And then you're just, you're getting so much nutrition. I think that's why I don't have many cravings now is because I'm eating so many greens the most nutrient-dense food on the planet, hands down, vegetables, then fruits. Then you, you wander off into sprout territory and 
little avocado and coconut here and there. You're having fun. I actually just started sprouting these mung beans the other day. They sprout quick. Holy cow. They're ready to eat within like 48 hours. So there's your protein if you ever needed any. Oh my god. I don't even think I need it. I've been beating all my records without these. I just added them yesterday, my first time. And so far, so good. So far, so good. So I think we're done here for today. Just wanted to give you this little banana tip. And thank you for watching. Thumbs up if you like the video. Thumbs down. If you have lamb testicles in your freezer instead of bananas, that's a 180. That's a 180. That's the opposite. That's the opposite. You should check yourself before you wreck yourself. Okay, that was lame. I'd like to leave now. I'll just go. Before I go, consider subscribing for more videos. Listen to my nurse song. It's, a, it's about a smoking nurse. I'm just a nurse who smokes and crosses the street. Come cross it with me. And I thought it would go viral for some reason, and it didn't. But that's okay. We'll get them next time. We'll get them. Okay, subscribe, and I'll go.